a joint security task force raided cannibal camps in Imo State and the Anambra State in Nigeria. This joint security task force, after they raided these cannibal camps in Imo State and the Anambra State, respectively, they discovered people who eat fresh human flesh. This task force discovered people who eat fresh human flesh in Anambra State and the Imo State. The task force, that is the joint task force now, include the Nigerian Army, the Nigerian Police, and the, the DSS. These are the joint security force that raided these cannibal camps. Now, before we continue to this video and see how these cannibals eat human flesh, they roast human flesh, eat them, and they dilute this human flesh with palm wine. If you really want to know what really happened, please click the red subscribe button below and then subscribe to my YouTube channel. Now that you have subscribed to my channel, let's go straight to this video and see how these cannibals roast human flesh, eat it, and they dilute it with palm wine. The director of DSS in Imo State, who is called Wilkos Edaminabo, said that the operation was carried out in Osu local government area in Imo State, Nigeria, as well as in Uli, Iyala, local government area in Anambra State. Now, let's look into and see how this cannibalism started in this area. Because according to the police now, they told the story of how these people became cannibals to an extent of roasting human beings and uh, eating them with palm wine so let's see how they became these cannibals according to the police now it was learned that then chased the people away they acted as kidnappers and invaded a community each in osu and the ihiala local government areas and they chased away the community after they have chased away the communities they took the areas for themselves in order to practice their cannibal lifestyle so these people acted as kidnappers they will kidnap the the members of that community they will kill them roast their body and eat them so when the killing and the eating of human beings we are too much in that area the whole community flee away and run to the nearby communities leaving this place for these people before the police now intervene so when the owners of the community ran away they informed the police officers and others but the police went there alone they couldn't overpower these men Yes, they couldn't. The DSS went there on their own. They couldn't overpower them. Even the Nigerian army went there on their own and they couldn't overpower them. Now, the three of them, both the police, the DSS, and the, the Nigerian army combined as a one squad to go and fight these cannibals before they were able to defeat them. Let's see what this security tax force we are able to discover in that cannibal zone according to the security agencies they said that they uncovered dead bodies decapitated human hairs and the roasted human bodies at the cannibals zone or the cannibals camp at their last operation which led to the arrest of over 30 cannibals in Imo State and the Anambra State, 
respectively. This happened in Nigeria, in Imo State, Nigeria, and the Anambra State, Nigeria. He went further to say that they saw a lot of human bodies, and the most of them do not have pass, some do not have hands, some do not have legs, and the many of the dead bodies there have been eaten half. And he went further to state as well that the methodology used by these cannibals to eat human flesh is through roasting and they, they normally or they usually eat this with palm wine. This incident happened in Osu in Imo State and the Iyala in Anambra State, Nigeria. The governor of one of the states, that's Imo State now, who goes by the name Governor Hope Uzodemma, was totally shocked when he heard the news of what is happening in his state. How cannibals has taken over his state and the roasting human beings and eating them with palm wine in his state and equally overpowering the powers of the police, the DSS, and the army in his state, called Imo State. He was even crying in the video. According to him, he cannot imagine how a human being can eat his fellow human being or derive joy in eating his fellow human being by roasting them and eating them with palm wine. Watch the video I'm going to play for you now to confirm the truth and the legitimacy of this story I'm telling you about now. Because the video I'm going to play for you is the video of Governor Hope Ozodemma, the governor of Imo State, where he was totally condemning and uh, attesting to the fact that the story I told you now is legit and the uh, truth. Watch the video and see it by yourself. I want to commend the security agencies in Imo State, the DSS, the Army, the Navy, the police, the civil defense, all of them. It has been a very thing of worry, wondering how entire local government like also local government will be abandoned in the, in the hands of criminals and cannibals who are killing human beings and roasting human beings, eating human beings, cannibals. How else are we supposed to treat this kind of idiots if not to ensure that the law takes its course? Now you have seen the video, you have seen that people, some people in Imo State and Anambra State specializes in killing human beings, they will roast them and eat them with palm wine. So you seen the governor of Imo State, Hope Ozodemma, testifying to this story I'm telling you now. So many things are happening. Please let's desist from doing evil. Remember that I am on your committer. Everything you do, I must see it and uh, say it here. You have seen my big eyes. I use these eyes you see here to see everything that happened. Now, if you really want to know the latest of crimes, please click the red subscribe button below and subscribe to my channel so that anytime I upload a new video, you will be able to see it. Thanks for watching on this one. Bye for now.